In this video, I will go through the signs for officers of the SCA. These are signs that are pretty universal across all of the kingdoms of the known world. Um, they exist in the East Kingdom as well as pretty much anywhere else. So you can use them in the East. You can also use them when you travel. They will be more or less the same wherever you go. Now, that being said, some kingdoms might have different signs for the same titles. Check with that Kingdom Sign Language Herald if you're not sure. All right, we're going to try and go in alphabetical order here. The first uh, officer is an autocrat, the person who is in charge of an event. The sign for autocrat is essentially their job title. They are the event manager. So the sign for event has both of your index fingers start palms out, or palms up rather, flip to palms down, now rotate 90 degrees and make two X finger shapes and uh, move back and forth. This is a sign for manage. And then we add the person sign on the end of that. So they are the event manager or the autocrat. The next officer on our list is the chatelaine, who is the person who welcomes newcomers and helps them to start on their path in the SCA. The chatelaine is the welcome person. So the sign for welcome is you're doing sort of a half scoop. It's not a full scoop. You're not starting with your palm down. You're more starting with your palm um, sideways and um, out a bit from your body. So you do half scoop towards, uh, towards your chest and then you bring up your other hand and you make your person sign. So the chatelaine is the welcome person. Chatelaine. Our next officer, oop, I lied, this is not 100% alphabetical. Our next officer is the Chancellor Minor. Chancellor Minor is, of course, the person who keeps an eye on the kids at an event, keeps them busy, makes sure that they are having a good time and um, helping out, participating in whatever way they want to. So the Chancellor Minor is the person who takes care of the children. They are the children carer. All right, so the sign for children is Put your hands out in front of you and pretend you are patting several small heads in front of you uh, to show that they're children. The sign for taking care is your two V hand shapes that you stack perpendicular to each other and tap. That's the sign for taking care. And then you add your person sign onto the end of that. So the Chancellor Minor is the child carer, the Chancellor Minor. All right, our next officer is the chronicler. Your chronicler is the person who takes meeting minutes, um, keeps, uh, keeps track of uh, documents and notes and whatnot, and is basically your group's record keeper, which is why the chronicler is the record person. So the sign for record is holding your non-dominant hand out palm up. Take your dominant hand, pinch all your fingers together, tap the middle of your palm, and then open up and put your palms together. Think of it as you're putting something down on paper and then you're sealing it in a record. So it's the record person or the chronicler. Next um, officer is the exchequer. The exchequer is essentially the cup club treasurer. They are in charge of all things financial for an, a, an event and for your group's activities in general. So they are the money exchanger. All right, the sign for this one is, um, is a little, little tricky. So the sign for money is hold your non-dominant hand palm out, um, pinch, your, pinch your dominant fingers together, but sort of flatten them. So you've got sort of four, um, four side by side, and then your thumb, and then tap the front of your non-dominant hand. This is a sign for money in sign language. And then you're going to make the same money sign with your non-dominant hand and move them in very shallow circles. It's more of a back and forth motion than it is a circular around motion, so very shallow. And that is one of the ways to sign exchanging something. And then, of course, we add on person. So the money exchanger is the exchequer. The next officer is the marshal of various activities. Now this, um, this has a number of subcategories in it. The basic sign for marshal is take your two index fingers 
and cross them in an X. This uh, is a throwback to the heraldry of any marshal in the SCA. If you look at any of the heraldry for any marshal activity, whether it's heavy, rapier, um, equestrian, thrown weapons, archery, anything, the device for a marshal is always the particular weapons of whatever they are authorized in crossed. So we cross our fingers to mimic the badge or the heraldry of the marshals. Now that's our base sign. To go into more specifics about what specific marshal they are, you add on or put, uh, it goes first, you add on first the sign of whatever they are a marshal for. For example, they could be a heavy weapons marshal. They could be a rapier marshal. They could be an archery marshal. They could be a thrown weapons marshal. They could be an equestrian marshal. Now, if somebody is learning how to be a marshal, they are, of course, a marshal learner or as we know them better, a marshal in training. So you make your marshal sign and then you make the sign for student, which is hold your non-dominant hand out, take your dominant hand, pull something um, off, of, off of your non-dominant hand, bring it up to your forehead. That is, that is the sign for learning. Think of your pulling knowledge out of your source and putting it into your head so that you learn it. And then of course you add your person sign onto the end. So a marshal, student is an MIT. Now, if you're, if you're the marshal in charge, you are, of course, the big boss marshal who is in charge of all the other marshals in that given activity, which is why the sign for an MIC is marshal boss. So, so the sign for boss is take, um, take your dominant hand, make a claw shape, and tap your shoulder. That is the sign for boss. So the marshal in charge is the marshal boss. All right, our next office is our Minister of Arts and Sciences, the person who takes care of all ANS activities, um, organizes classes and whatnot um, within the group or the kingdom. So the sign for Minister of Arts and Sciences is they are the art and science manager. So our sign for arts and sciences is art, which is hold your non-dominant hand out, take your index finger, and draw across it. Think about you're pretending to do art on your hand if your hand is a canvas or a piece of paper or what have you. That's the sign for art. To make the sign for science, make fists, stick your thumbs out, and wave them in alternating circles. This is the sign for science. Think about you're pouring stuff out of beakers into a larger vessel in front of you. And then manager, as we've uh, talked about before, is two X's that could move back and forth and then we add our person onto the end. So the arts and sciences manager is our minister of arts and sciences. Our next officer is the seneschal, who is essentially the club president, which is why the sign for seneschal is in ASL, the sign for president. Make two C hand shapes, cross them in front of your forehead, pull them apart and bring them into fists. That is the sign for president, or in our case, Seneschal. And our last officer is our web minister, the person who manages emails, uh, group websites, and that sort of thing. So naturally, they are um, the person who manages internet-related businesses for a group or for a kingdom, which is why the sign for the web minister is the internet manager. So for internet, point your middle fingers down on both hands, bring them to touch in the middle, and then we make our sign for manager, two X's that go back and forth with our person sign at the end. So the internet manager is the web minister. Okay, let's try and go over all of that again. We're gonna start with the autocrat. Autocrat. Next we have the chatelaine. Chatelaine. And then we have our chancellor minor. Chancellor minor. And then we have the chronicler, chronicler, and then we have the exchequer, exchequer. Next is the marshal, marshal, heavy weapons marshal, rapier marshal, archery marshal, thrown weapons marshal, 
equestrian marshal, marshal in training, marshal in charge. After the marshal comes our minister of arts and sciences, minister of arts and sciences. After the minister of arts and sciences is the seneschal, seneschal, and last but not least is the web minister web minister. All right, there you go. There is your list of all of the major officers in the Kingdom of the East in most local regional branches and within the whole of the SCA.